Happy Sunday, St. Paul's, and welcome to this week's Sunday virtual Sunday school. So where are we in our stories? We are right now still in the Gospel of Matthew. Now, our parable this morning, it happens during the end of the season after Pentecost. So this is known as the ordinary time, which we've talked about quite a bit this season. And this is a great way to emphasize that we need to be prepared at all times. So we're not just waiting for Jesus during Advent or Lent, but each and every day. So find a comfy seat and I will be see you soon for our story time. Well, I hope you found a comfy spot for our story today. Now, as I mentioned in our opening today, we are still in the Gospel of Matthew. And our story today comes from the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 25. So settle in and let's hear our story. It is called Five Were Ready and Four Were Not. Are you ready for God's kingdom? Jesus asked his disciples. The disciples looked at each other. They hoped they were ready. But what did Jesus really mean? Before you answer my question, Jesus said, listen to this story. It will help you understand. The wedding was soon. Ten bridesmaids rushed around to get ready. They counted their oil lamps, ten, one for each bridesmaid, to light during the party. The ten bridesmaids packed their oil tents, their oil, ten oil lamps. Five packed extra oil to make sure the lamps shone, shone bright throughout the night, and five forgot their extra oil. All of the bridesmaids waited and waited and waited and waited to light their lamps, but the groom didn't arrive. The moon rose in the sky. The bridesmaids began to yawn. They were sleepy. Loud shouts woke the bridesmaids from their sleep. The groom is here. Let the party begin. Ten bridesmaids jumped up to light their lamps. Five bridesmaids marched into the wedding party with lamps shining bright. The five bridesmaids ran out of oil and their lights burned out. Give us some oil for our lamps, they begged. But the five bridesmaids with the extra oil wouldn't share. Run home and get some. Hurry, they said. Five of the bridesmaids weren't ready, and they missed the whole party. Always be ready for the kingdom of God. Okay, well, I will see you all after your craft. See you soon. Hi, Pre-K and K. I hope you enjoyed your craft this week. Now, in our story, we talked about 10 bridesmaids. So how many were ready for the party and how many were not? Why did some of them miss the party? And what do you think Jesus wants us to be ready for? And what do you think the kingdom of heaven is like? Is it like a wedding party? I want you to think on those questions. Hi, Pre-K and K. Welcome back for our Bible bit this week. So in the Bible wedding stories, the bridegroom generally represents Christ, while the bride represents Christians or the church, and the wedding feast represents heaven or a reconciled future. So that's your little fun fact of the day. I'll see you soon. Well, St. Paul's, thank you for a wonderful virtual Sunday school this week. The parable of the 10 bridesmaids is so important and it reminds us to always be ready for God and the second coming of Jesus. And I will see you all next week. Stay healthy and stay well. Bye.